Hello, and welcome back to the Guild Wars Let's Play. Uh, where we ended last time, we needed to teleport back to Ascalon City, which is where we are now. Cool. And uh, we can go turn in this quest. The primary quest wanted us to come back here. So we're going to come over here, talk to this guy. A message from Murik, is it? Let me see that. This is grave news indeed. I hope he's mistaken about this. Duena, protect us if this information is accurate. If such a thing is even possible, then King Aldoburn has ordered this offense against the Char not a moment too soon. We must not lose this fight, I tell you. We must not lose this fight. So Titus wants to take on his secondary profession before you face the Char, right? Uh, I think he is right to say so. A second profession gives you the access to... Yeah, nah, nah, nah. But anyway... We'll worry about this later. Getting a second profession makes you better than not having a second one. But I don't want to take that yet. So that leads towards the completion of the whole thing. So we'll wait there for now. We can leave that there. We'll get a second profession later. You can do the whole... Like, we could pretty much get ready to leave pre-setting if you wanted. There's so much more to pre-setting. I won't leave yet. All right, let's see. Grim news from Devana in Ashford. A clan of Grawl has swept north from the woods and onto the lakeside county. If they are not stopped, the village will surely be destroyed. Someone must fight these creatures and protect the people of Ashford. Coordinate your efforts with Devona. Right. Trouble in the woods. Just might as well grab some quests while we're here, yeah? I think that seems, seems like a fair idea. Alas, I am behind on my rent, and my landlord, Gelson, has run out of patience with me. I fear I will be put out of my home. I'll understand if you'd rather not help a Crichton. Our nations were at war a long for at for are were at war a long time. Huh. Our nations were at war a long time. For a long time. But I'm not your enemy, and I could really use some assistance. My friend, Miller Upton, lives to the southwest. I know he'll help me if I can get a message to him. If you're going that way, could you tell him of my plight? Certainly have I refused. But this is what a Crichton... This is the Crichtons. This is how they look. Like, where are the Ascalonians? That's a Crichton. Yeah, fairly, fairly big beef boy compared to that. Yeah, that's our. That's a Crichton. I'm wearing Crichton gloves. These gloves come from Crichton. Alright. Kim's the historian. Weapons, weapons... Look at all these people playing. So many actual players. There we go. I'm sorry to bother you, but I've heard some impressive things about you, and I think only someone with your skill and bravery can help with my problem. I think my brother, Orion, has fallen ill with uh, fallen in with the Royalists. He's not wicked, just reckless and impulsive. When Sir Titus expelled him from the Academy, he became embittered toward the, towards the army. But I don't think he realizes how serious this is. I don't want him to throw I don't want him to throw his life away out for foolish pride. Do you think you could find him and tell him what I said? Perhaps convince him to come home? I don't know exactly where he is, but I imagine Rolena Stormbringer in Fulbul's Fair might. Or was always trying to impress her. He might have told her something. I'll bring your brother home. The wayward wizard. Here's some people. Lieutenant Lagmar, I am Langmar of the Ascalon Vanguard. After you have some more experience under your belt, I might have some tasks for you. Once you have proven your ability to get a I will have to give you skills. Okay, so I can get some stuff there. I gotta wait until I'm a higher level. <laughs> I love it, just like this one house up here. Now, let's see. Hello, good citizen. I am uh, Baron Egan. And you appear to be needing of assistance. What can I help you with? The Poison Devourer. The Devourer Cave southwest of town has always been a source of danger to the people of Lakeside County, but they have learned to be vigilant and to defend themselves from the beasts. Unfortunately, I've been hearing recently of a new sort of Devourer with a poisonous sting. I'd like you to find one of these creatures, kill it, and make and take its poisonous stinger to Brother Menlo in Ashford Abbey. You got it. We're probably going to go back to that Devourer okay, where we got the eggs, probably. And Bandit Raid. A group of bandits have been terrorizing Lakeside recently. They have grown so bold that they ambushed a royal tax collector and stole a chest full of gold. 
That gold is vital to our war effort against the Char and must be recovered. You look like you could give those bandits a good thrashing. Will you do, uh, recover the stolen chest and then return it to Devona and Ashford for me? Sure thing. Easy enough. Sweet deal. Alright. Picking up those sweet, sweet quests. Everybody's favorite thing to do is get the quest, right? And then, let's see. Uh, nothing over here. I think one of these guys actually makes something pretty decent, if I recall. Uh, don't worry, really put too old. All right, well, let's sell. Now we can customize. I forgot you can customize a weapon, which makes it stronger, but then you can't sell it. I remember, or trade it. I remember that. Um, Kylo Axe of Fortitude. The plus fives are Rin Blade. That's what we. 10 to 14? Mm -mm. We need five iron. I don't think we've gotten any iron. Five iron, 100 gold for a nice, strong Rin Blade. And that gives us uh, plus five versus the char, which would come in handy. No shields, though. Well, okay. That Rin Blade might not be too bad. We can work on that. Kim's historian. I've come here looking to document the stories of only the greatest achievements. Tell me, what is it about you that makes you incredible? That's a Hall of Monuments thing. That guy didn't come until way later. Oh, look. My liege. He has a, the prince. A group of char have broken through the gates. They must be stopped at all costs. Meet me at the gates just outside of town in Lakeshire. What say you? Will you help me drive these char far from Ascalon? From Fair Asclon. Drive these charts from Fair Asclon. I'm with you. You got a cool sword, and I like your armor, and you got a cool shield, and you got a cape. No reason, with no reason not to follow him. Here we go over here and see some of this stuff over here. I always just like getting as much as you can. Here's Sin. This, well, I'm not in the mood to chat, so scram. Oof. Uh, this is Sin. She was the female um, elementalist in the cinematic that we watched in the beginning. She's the elemental of sin. She'll be another prominent NPC character. And then this is where that cutscene was. Or close to it. There, as you can say. Or close to it. You can see there's the king. King Ottoburn and his scribe. From the beginning cutscene over there. And this is that fight that's just... It's just cool that you can see this fight that's going on constantly. Against the bloody char. Basically, we're, we're starting out and proving our worth to join the army to actually fight those Char. But let's do what our what our liege needs. He's like, please, let's go kill him. Alright, I think I picked up all the quests that I per currently can, uh, other than the primary. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's not worry about that right now. <laughs> that guard's like stuck in the wall. <laughs> uh, look at that. Help me! Oh god, I'm stuck in the wall. Please help me. <laughs> Alright. I'm on we're pretty good. Let's go. Um, to the gate. Follow me. You got a man after you. Look, and Captain Orsic has one too. This guy's got a cool sword as well. Oh man, is Prince Rurik actually running at, like, person speed? Holy crap, an NPC who moves at NPC speed. Laid off it. There's a quest there. But we're on a mission. We gotta follow my prince. Cut some stuff. So, this quest here is showing us that there's actually... You can actually go north of the wall. This is the Great Wall. The Great Northern Wall keeps up the char. Um, you can, in fact, there is a way to go north of it in pre -searing. Yeah, It's basically where, like, it's really hard to say. It's really confusing to say this, but it's the end game area of the prologue tutorial. It's a tutorial end game. All right, stand your ground. All right, here we go. Ow. When are you guys going to get in there? There we go. I was like, um, you guys getting in there? Boom. Yeah, hey, we leveled up. 
you know, you're not likely to die here as long as the other two are there as well, but. That should teach them the fear that might have asked Ascalon. You fought well. I see great deeds in your future, young lazy sage. And he gave us a sword. Same plus 15 while health... Okay, that's definitely more useful than that. More standard, more traditional looking though. Less, uh, less unique looking. But honestly, I kind of like it more. I feel more traditional. And honestly, it's just better for us. Five more armor versus physical damage, which we're going to deal with a lot. 15% more damage will help us above 50%. So while we have more than half our life, we do way more. We do 15% more damage. That's awesome. Attribute points. Uh, you know what? Do another... Another... Be strong with our sword. You know, we can throw one in our tactics. And we're healing signals a little better. So there's still one bad guy. Still, oh, bandit, a bandit. See the one who let them in? I don't know. Well, that's my fan fiction now. Where you going, man? Where are you going? Where are you going? I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. <laughs> He's, there we go. Wow, he, he was not having it. Oh, we do so much more damage now. Look at this. Oh. I'm gonna pretend he let them in. And yeah, we killed them. Revenge! Alright. And we can keep going this way. This way leads to another map. Leads to the next area. Look at that Balthazar up the there. That leads to Green Hills County. So that's pretty good. You could go that way. I think if we have all these quests now, we need to pick a quest and I get to it. Bandit raid. It'd be closer if we go from Asher Abbey, but we can just cut through. We'll just cut through right now. We need to add to the map. Well, we won't really add to the map considering we've already been here, but the map's already cleared. Ooh, level three, huh? Let's see how this goes. The, all these growls. So this is a growl. They're weird. They, they still exist in Guild Wars 2 as well. They're a weird race. Like, they're smart enough to use tools. Like bows. But they're uh, also like simple-minded enough where they're easily tricked. Like if you show a display of power, they'll think you're a god. And uh, they'll basically worship you. They'll worship anything. They're basically quick to worship things. They'll worship whatever. If something shows them power, they'll worship it. They'll accept it. Uh, you know what I think will be better than Life Siphon, maybe? I mean, Life Siphon gives us health and does damage slowly. And gives us Deadly Swarm. But, like, the Phantasm... You'll see. You know, you'll see what I'm talking about. We're gonna go over here. We want to get this quest from them. But let's, uh... This is like the amphitheater. This is like a little theater. And we have this... The twin goddess of Lissa. The goddess of illusion. It's like two gods back to back, or two, late, two twins back to back. And it was that a stranger came to the village of Wern seeking shelter and employment. Though young in years, her body was stooped and twisted, her flesh eaten by disease. Ye have the mark of plague upon ye, said the citizen named Galdrick. Leaveth this place, else you sicken our people. I have lost my family and my home, cried the desperate woman. Have you no heart? Yet each person in turn did turn her away. Then from the crowd came a young woman, Sarah. She looked upon the woman with pity. If you need help, said Sarah, I will give it. And did Sarah approach the gnarled, bent woman and to give her a helping hand? Then the sickened woman pulled from her body the robes of plague, revealing herself to be the goddess Lissa. The people of Rurn fell to their knees, begging Lissa's mercy. But, lifting Sarah gently, saith she, True beauty is measured not by appearance, but by actions and deeds. Many have eyes, but few have seen. 
Of all here, you saw the beauty behind the illusion, and you alone shall be blessed with my gifts. Scriptures of Lissa, 45 BE. Yeah. Interesting little stories. Interesting. I always like, I liked reading the little things. Oh, oh look, Althea's acting stage. Perfect. Lady Althea, a mesmer's burden. At the watering hole southwest of here, you will find a rogue bull. Terrible creature, a menace to everyone coming to visit our humble theater. Here are some mesmer spells to assist you. If you dispatch the cre this creature for me, I'd be most grateful. Teach me some mesmer skills. Boom. So now we have... Uh, energy law too. That's not bad. Their feast. Lose three energy, gain 20 health for each point of, en of energy lost. Now the phantom, this is what I was talking about really, the conjure phantasm. It's not a lot of damage. It like, doesn't last very long, two seconds, but negative five healthy gen is a pretty decent smacking of negative right there. Watch, we throw it on this bad boy. Mm, dead. See how fast it died? I don't know if you did or not, but it was quick. <laughs> you know, throw it on this person. Mm. Right, and that's only for that's just for two seconds. Ooh, I know that the Grawl necklaces are eventually something useful. Like I know I get to, I know I can use them later to do something. Great, they probably they're probably wanted for something. You know, another piece of this collector armor. Get the flat bow. Alright, we gotta knock out this rogue bull. It's a mad bull. Pull charge. Using an elite skill. Yeah, not, we'll learn about those later. Yeah. <laughs> Smack time. Choo, choo. Mm -hmm. Give him the phantasm. That phantasm. Now we'll go turn that in. <laughs> so yeah, so it's like conjured phantasm. And why is it called conjured phantasm? Well, because we're conjuring it in the person's mind. We're psychically attacking them, basically. Same thing with imagined burden. They feel like they're heavy, and they feel slower, because you're messing with their mind. Back already? Excellent. I can't thank you enough for taking care of the dangerous bull. Yeah, and then, no, I need more time to decide. Alright. And, uh, Lady Athea, um, this is actually our, you know, our prince, Prince Rurik, that quest we did with the gate. Uh, this is his wife-to-be. They're engaged currently. In the plot. So that's to be... Uh, Rurik's wife. The eventual queen, eventually. Theory. Hello, what's on your mind? Oh, it looks like Average Dan's got some quests for us. You got Average Dan. If you wish to adventure, to advance your skills as a warrior, you should study under War Master Grast in the Green Hills country. Okay. If you follow the road northwest from town and pay attention to the signs, you shouldn't have any trouble finding Green Hills County. Grass will be near the statue of Balthazar. Thanks for the suggestion. Yeah, new warrior trainer. Well, let's see if we can give Gwen anything. That's a pretty flower. Give the flower to Gwen. I see that she already has the cape, although I didn't give it to her. Probably because I partied up for the person who had it already. But anyway, yeah. How am I supposed to give you all the flowers? How many flowers am I supposed to give you? Well, there. She has her flute. She she has her cape. Um, she has. I gave her a bunch of flowers. There. All right. And what we'll do now is we look at our quests. We want to do the bandit raid. This requires us to go somewhere else. Poor tenant. This is down there. 
poison of ours over here. Everything's basically over by Ashford Abbey. So let's go to the Abbey. Dun, 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 perfect. <laughs> Attune me, step bro. <laughs> that's a <laughs> that's a good name. I'm sorry, it's funny. All right. Well, we'll go outside here, and we'll uh, let's do the bandit raid because that's right there over there. All right. And that's what we'll uh, that's what we'll do. We'll do some quests in this area. That'll be the next uh, best thing, I think. Oh, and now we gotta kill a wolf real quick. All right. Stupid wolf. I'm trying to end the episode and you wanna fight? Got him. That wolf didn't stand a chance. All right, thank you for watching this part of the Let's Play. I really appreciate it. And I will catch you in the next episode. Till then, stay super.